brought to you through the regional support of First 5 Fresno County, First 5 Tulare County, and First 5 Madera County. Because it's all about the kids. Hello, I'm Wendy to Stevenson. Welcome to Zero to Five in 30 Minutes. Thousands of people are homeless in Fresno and for many different reasons. Sadly, a large portion of that population is made up of children. It is tough for families trying to raise children when there is no place to call home, but there is help. This is moving day for Angela Tovar and her children. Mindy, what'd you do with the other bus pass? They are moving into emergency housing where they'll be able to stay for three months. And so it's real hard for me to get a place, so I'm always living with people and people, and finally I just, finally just I have to think of my, about my kids. Angela says it's been tough for her children who range in age from 3 to 12 years since she became separated from their father. I know they're struggling because what I'm going through, they see me always in depression and everything, so they, um, I think it's taken pretty hard on them because um, what I'm going through and plus me and their dad are not together anymore, so it's kind of hard for them. This young family spent the last 30 days at the Fresno Rescue Mission, a temporary shelter in downtown Fresno. Robin Bump is the manager. She says their doors are always open to families in need. When a family comes through here, um, first thing they think of is it's on G Street and you know they like oh that's a bad part of town but when they walk through the front door and see what we have it's total opposite of what you would think a shelter is. Um, each family has their own room here. The nonprofit facility provides families with food, clothing and shelter. And these washers and dryers are going constant. Each family has to pitch in here and share in the responsibilities of keeping the place up. And of course, there are rules that everyone must follow. There is no drugs or alcohol here, and we do random testing. And then everybody helps with household chores. And we have three meals a day here, and we have chapel services here, and we have groups that come here and do activities with the kids. And I mean, it's like home here. Providing for her family isn't easy. Right now, Angela's income consists of a monthly assistance check from the government. And it barely helps me out to get there with, with their shoes or so, you know, stuff like that. So some people like my friends, they like donate their clothes to my kids. So. It's a high priority to make sure the children's health needs are met. Angela tells us her kids do have insurance and see their doctor regularly. Oh yeah, they're in good condition, yeah. They're all dated up and when they feel sick, I take them in. And... The fact is, the homeless are getting younger. Over the last couple of years and stuff, we've seen a lot of younger families in their 20s with little ones coming through here. Robin says it's important to be supportive of parents as they look for ways to take care of their kids. They are being good parents because they are here. They have a roof over their head for their children and they're not out on the streets. Angela is looking for a way to get permanent housing for her kids. I'm trying to see if I can get a job or anything. I'm still looking for an apartment so I can um, get my kids in, in an apartment, so. In the meantime, parents need to keep in mind their children are going through turmoil and they need reassurance. They need to understand that what you're going through, they're going through it too. And you just need to make sure that everything's gonna be okay. They're gonna be safe no matter what the situation is. The city of Fresno is currently working on a 10-year plan to end chronic homelessness. You can read more about it by going to our website. Just go to kvpt.org and click on 0 to 5 in 30 minutes. Brought to you through the regional support of First 5 Fresno County. 
First Five Tulare County, and First Five Madera County. Because it's all about the kids. <laughs>